Okay, then let's have a look. Well, maybe it is some, also some news. So um, I will post a link in the chat. So you might have missed that. It, it was posted on the um, uh, on the HFE forum. So this has been done by uh, Antago, the German company. And um, you may know that feature basically, because if you know Lumi, like it's a desktop application that you can use to to edit and view HFE content types or content. And um, you can also export it to HTML, so single HTML files. And this is similar, but maybe you don't use Lumi or you need an online service that does it for some reason. Um, could even integrate it in some web page if you wanted to. So you can just drop H5E content and it, could, it would show. So what you, what you can do here is really just take an um, H5P file. So I would just do that. I have one on my desktop, which is the um, normal fill in the blanks demo content from H5P.org. So if I open that, it will be, you see it's really quick. So it is converted and you see, I now got a new field here, which is, um, which I can use to download that, and I'll put that on the desktop as well. And you can see it has um, the, the uh, extension .zip, so it's a zip file. And I can save that. And um, if we have a look at that file, so this is how it looks. So it just has one folder, which is called content, one which is called libraries, one readme file, and uh, one HTML file. So it's pretty similar to what um, Lumi does. And what I could do now is I could extract that to my desktop. And of course it will be cluttered now. So all that stuff is now on my desktop and I can have a look at all the files. I can close the archive. So there are all the files. And if I double click on the HTML file, you'll see, okay, this is um, the normal fill in the blanks demo content and it's running. I can, I can type stuff here. So just works like H5P and it's running from my desktop. So um, it doesn't have to be my desktop. Um, it could be web server as well if you wanted to, but this is kind of an, uh, a way to, to use HFP content offline if you don't use Lumi for um, yeah for converting stuff. Or again, if you want to have built your own online service, you can contact the guys from Antares, I guess. And um, you could integrate H5P kind of conveniently. You have to still create it somewhere else, but you can just drop your files and they could be on your platform even if it doesn't support um, if it doesn't feature an H5P plugin. So this might be useful. 